Okay, I have two things for you here in the category of how do I make this look a little more easy to read. So this can be found in the edit menu. It is edit beautify. You can also find it here with a magic wand. Ding! Beautiful. It's not, you know, it's not perfect. So I had an extra space here. It's going to maintain my space. If I want to get rid of that, I'm going to have to take it out myself. Um, because I was a little sloppy when I paste cut when I did my cutting and pasting, but it will do the indents for you magically. Okay, so that's looking a lot better. Let's do the OL. When it beautified, of course, I probably should have done the tags before I beautified because it couldn't see where my numbers were or it didn't understand that this was going to be a list. But here is where my list is going to be. So I'm going to take each one of these items and remove, actually I'm going to forget where they are so I'm going to do them one at a time. So I don't think I'm good enough to remember where the numbers started. And then this is going to be my next li. Okay. Here's my ending li tag, which will go at the end of each line. This becomes my next list item. Then I paste in my ending tag and the beginning of my next tag until I am done. So OL and UL share the same list item tags, LI. Definition list has DT and DD, so it's completely different structure. Here, is my, here are my LIs, and now I will proceed to put in the ordered list tag, OL, to surround all of my LIs. Save and hit the beautify button. Ah, now I can, I like my indents. Let's check it in the, I'm going to save again since I just formatted and check it in the browser by refreshing. Command R, Control R, or you can also just click the refresh button. And now I have an order, an unordered list and an ordered list here. Um, let's get this whole thing in gear. In the next video, we'll take, we'll tackle the description list.